Although not all customer accounts can be deleted, you can delete some that have no orders. So here's how to do that. First, click into customers on the left hand side. And I do want to say for this video, I'm not giving legal advice as to when you need to delete a customer. I'm just showing you how you can delete a customer. And I want to go in the Shopify help center and explain a few things over there of how Shopify explains deleting a customer. So here under deleting customer profiles, you can delete individual profiles. Alternatively, you can delete multiple in bulk. So I can show you both. When a customer profile is deleted, the customer's personal data, such as their name and address is also redacted from Shopify's records. But you cannot delete customer profiles in the following cases if the customer has order history so if they've ordered anything on your site they have an order history and they cannot be deleted now you can erase their information but you cannot fully delete the customer if the customer has pending redaction because of a gdpr erasure request then you cannot delete the customer i believe this is just the standard you're trying to erase their data so if that is pending you cannot delete their customer account if the customer has an active subscription now or if the customer ever had a subscription in the past you can not delete them and if the customer is the recipient of a scheduled gift card that has not been delivered yet you also cannot delete the account and then if you attempt to delete multiple profiles in bulk only the profiles that can be deleted will be deleted and then it cannot be undone once you delete a profile so I'm going to go back and I'm going to show you deleting a profile and I'll show you some instances where you cannot delete the profile. Okay, so if you wanted to delete multiple profiles in bulk, you can just select a bunch of different ones and then you'll see down here, there's this little pop up that appears so you can bulk edit if you want to, but we're going to want to click these three little dots over here and then you'd want to click delete customers. I don't actually want to delete all of the ones that I have selected, so I'm not going to delete them all, but I'm going to show you not being able to delete one with an order. So now I have deselected all of them except just one and this one has one order you'll notice over here so I will not actually be able to delete it because it has order history so I'm going to hit delete customer and now this pop-up has appeared it's asking are you sure you want to delete this customer customers with the following items won't be deleted an order history pending redaction because of an erasure request or active subscription and so I'm going to put that I would like to delete it and then down here it is saying failed deleting one customer. It doesn't really give you the reason why, but that order history is why I cannot delete it. Now I'm gonna click into an account I'm just going to click into this top one. It's just a test account and I'm going to show you deleting that one. Okay, so once you're in here, you'll click more actions near the top right corner and then go down to delete customer. So then it's asking, are you sure you want to delete the customer? This cannot be undone. And I am going to want to delete this one. So I'm just going to hit delete customer. And that customer is now deleted. Now the next one in line was that one that I tried to delete with one order. So the only reason why I was able to delete the one I did delete is because it had zero orders, so it had no order history. One thing to note is that Shopify is not very good at explaining if deleting the customers deletes all the information for that customer in apps. If you erase the data, it's supposed to delete all the information shared with the apps, but it doesn't necessarily say if you just delete it, if it is fully deleted. So if you have a customer requesting for their data to be erased that might be something you need to look into and maybe you'd want to go the route where you would delete the information before you would fully delete the account if you can even delete the account because again if the customer has ordered anything you won't be able to delete the account you'll just be able to erase their information 